What's going on, man? Yeah, Nick, 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 come in here, man. This is Nick. Um, he's a good basketball uh, coach. He's one of the one of sort of the best coaches around, in my opinion. He's here at the university. He's he's helping me out with just one move. It's good to have him on board. Okay, so guys, this 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 tutorial right here. We're going to go through the legs, kind of a wrap around through the legs, like almost like a what would you call it, Nick? Like a inverted uh, yeah. inverted wrap cross. In yeah, it's a cool move. We're going to get into this way of how to put the basketball through someone's legs, but the alternative way. Let's get into it. Okay, so we're gonna show you from this side first, okay? So Nick can get into any, any position he wants, okay, as I come to him, okay? He's chosen to go with his right leg first, okay? In my tutorials, I'm always talking to you about matching your feet up to pull certain moves off okay so i know straight away now my left leg has to be matching him so i'm mirroring i'm mirroring nick okay you can see it right here okay i'm slowing uh showing you in slow motion okay as you're here okay now you have an opportunity to wrap the basketball around and go through his legs this way okay a lot of people obviously would go through the legs this way because that's the easiest way to do it but i'm trying to show you you can actually get the wrap around um, this way okay so it's in slow motion, let's change angle. Let's just show him one more from this way, okay? So remember what I said, mirror the defender. Okay, you're here, okay, wrap round. You've got the move here. One more time here, Nick. Okay, so you're here. Now, what I say in my tutorial is lull, lull the defender to sleep, okay? Same move over and over, okay? So he's not really moving, okay? Then you've got the move here. If the defender's moving like a crazy person, okay, you're not gonna pull off this move. The defender has to be nice. Hands up nice, match him up nice, and you can pull that move off, okay? So, how, how do we do it nice and, nice and so? You're looking to put your left leg, extend your left leg, okay? So now you're in this position, okay? And wrap it round through the legs, okay? So, maybe if you can get someone to help you, defender's arms are up, so they're not gonna get the basketball from you, and you're just gonna go round, same thing. So you're not actually moving, just using your step, bam. Step, bang, okay? So defender here, step, and through your legs, okay? Obviously, if Nick was to put his right foot forward, you would then mirror him the other side, okay? And then you would come around this side, okay? That's the wrap around, through the legs move. Um, let's try and show you in a little bit faster. So Nick's gonna come from, say, the blue line. We're gonna come, we're gonna come. I'm gonna slow the defender down now, okay? So I'm gonna try and put him in the position, okay? Here. Step through the legs, okay? And that's the move right there. Obviously, afterwards, you can either laugh at him, pull up a jump shot, lay up, whatever you want to do. Uh, Nick, if, if the defender's fast enough, do you think that you, you, you'd fall for that? I'd fall for that if I was playing defense. Yeah, so you have to be good defense. Uh, Nick just also told me, uh, my mic's right here, Nick. Is it easier to get defenders who are great defenders or worse defenders? The better you're defending, the more likely you are to fall for these moves. The better the defender, the more likely it is that you're going to fall for these moves, okay? So this is what I'm trying to say. Once defenders are defending really well, and you know what you're doing with the movement and matching up feet, you can pull off a lot of these moves. Okay, so we're going to speed it up a little bit, but remember what I said, to pull off, pull off this move, the defender has to be static, okay? You almost have to be, you know, boring, okay, for him to stay still, and then you can pull off the move, okay? And you've got it. Nick, thank you so much for being part of the tutorial. Um, and I'll be back with some more street ball moves and all the kind of freestyle stuff, trick shots and more. So make sure you subscribe, head over to my Facebook and Instagram for way more. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon.